I can't believe the people that are out here right now. When that fog rolls in, it rolls in fast. It's in the 30s, which is weird. It's the end of May, and it's in the 30s. No views tonight, but hopefully in the morning it'll burn off and I can show you the beautiful views up here. Well, right here is where I could uh, usually show you a view. <laughs> it's sprinkling um, mid 30s and I should have waited down there a little longer for a better parking spot, but it was so crowded. But now a lot of people are leaving because they're socked in. This looks like a nice flat spot and all the trees around me should block out some of this wind. I am seriously hoping those little paths down through there are from deer and not bear, <laughs> but it doesn't matter because I do have my bear spray. More for humans than bears. This is home for tonight. Hopefully I can bring you a nice view in the morning and all this will burn off. Why don't you check out what I'm using for a pillow? It's so soft. <laughs> I've tried so many different things and I just I can't find anything that's not bulky, that's comfortable. I hate the blow up ones. It's still kind of early, but it's sprinkling and so foggy you can't see nothing, so I can't have a fire. So, I just lay here and listen to the wind. <laughs> Five o'clock in the morning. I'm going to try to see if I can get a picture of this moon. beautiful See if you can see this is ice on my tent. Let's walk up there. It's 5.30 in the morning, probably a sun at 6.30, but I don't think we're going to get to see it because that is moving in fast.
Sorry, it's still dark. I might as well pack up and get out of here because all of that's going to cover the sun coming up. I'll head back up the mountain before I head out. It doesn't know whether to focus on the fog or the mountains. my ritual. Take it down while it's soaking wet and then put it up in the yard to dry. I lay everything on my footprint. I fold everything up while everything is on my footprint so it won't get wet. And then I fold up my footprint with my pack on. And there you have it. Leave no trace. As always, I really appreciate you taking the time out of your day to watch my videos. Thank you. The life of a hiker. zoomed out. You see everything I see. Right there is where I should have camped last night. Of course it would have been twice as windy. I stayed down in the tree lines. Awesome view.
But they are beautiful. Thank you. Let's go, guys. This view never gets old. And the thing is, it was a very cold, wet night last night. And they are several people that actually stayed up here on the mountain, spread out all over. But all the way till one o'clock in the morning, I heard people leaving. Cause if you don't have the right equipment, you will freeze. And the only thing that got cold on me last night was my feet. So I'm going to invest in those uh, down footies. I know I say it a lot, but thanks so much for watching my video. I appreciate you. Have a wonderful day. right on the Tennessee-North Carolina border.